guys happy sunday it is sunday why do i always say that it's around 12 i'm getting ready to go out and meet with my friends we're headed to the markets and then we're gonna have a picnic by the lake i've woken up with like the world's biggest zip i know i shouldn't pop it but i want to so bad but i hope you're all having a great sunday and like a good start to your morning i finished uni classes this week so i'm just so happy so i don't have any of those weird like 1am starts or anything anymore and i can just study in my own time and like just enjoy like summer and just enjoy doing stuff with my friends so that's exactly what we're going to do today this is my outfit that i'm wearing if you watched my last video you would have seen that i did like a summer clothing haul so if you want more details on the outfit make sure you go and check out that video I totally forgot that i was supposed to make food to share with everyone i'm just gonna quickly make some like wraps and then we're gonna go to the markets <laughs> sorry it's taken a lot longer than what i actually was expecting but anyway story of my life No, no. Oh, there's so many. They're literally. I get glass, but they won't even have cooked you. Like. Hey guys, I just wanted to check in and say that I'm back from meeting with my friends in the park. We had like the most amazing afternoon. Just absolutely loving living in France and like it's just been so amazing to meet like the friends that I have. We were just in the park, we were playing like some silly games like would you rather and just like inventing the most randomest things. There was like heaps of birds around and like if you know me you know that I literally have the worst bird phobia ever. Like it's honestly horrible. In Europe there's literally pigeons and those like little sparrow things like everywhere. Right now um, I'm just drinking a tea and I'm trying to get some study done because I've really slacked off with it recently. I think I think just now that it's summer and stuff I'm just getting in the party mood and I'm just getting in the mood like I just want to hang out and I don't want to study anymore like I'm sick of it I have exams coming up halfway through this month so I really need to like start getting a move on with it all but I'll check in with you guys like once something amazing starts happening Hi guys, it's Tuesday and something amazing is finally happening. Like I said, I would restart vlogging once something was actually going on. And right now, Killian and I are on our way to get vaccinated. I have my vaccine first in a town like half an hour away and then we're gonna drive back. Killian's actually booked his in a different place. Um, so we're both getting vaccinated today and I'm just like really excited to get the vaccine and like, I don't know, I think it's just gonna be like good for society as a whole if everyone can get vaccinated and get like this herd immunity thing going. I'm not too worried about the pain or anything like that. I'm pretty good with needles. The only thing is some people do get some side effects from it, like feeling sick. We had one friend that was waking up in the night vomiting and stuff. So hopefully that doesn't happen to me, but you never know. I will try to vlog as much as I can, but um, no promises. I'll definitely update you. Okay guys, so I just got my vaccine. It was like pretty easy. They just took my information. They didn't even ask for my passport or anything. There was like a small room off to the side and she just like came in, like gave me the jab and then that was it. They didn't even tell me which one I was getting until after. So I ended up getting the Moderna, which was the only one that was there. And honestly, I don't know too much about the differences. I'm just happy that at least like I got one. My arm's feeling a bit like stingy and sore but I think that's just normal like every time after you get an injection it feels a bit like weird like that. Now we're on the way to get Killian's vaccine. So I got mine in like a small little pharmacy and Killian I think is going to a bigger centre where they're distributing them so we're gonna head there now. 
This is where Killian went to get his vaccine. So many people around, like there's literally so many cars. Like I swear the entire population of ANSI is getting vaccinated, which is just awesome to see. So Killian and I just quickly came home to get changed, leave the car. We're heading out to meet one of our friends at La Buvette, which is a bar that we're normally going to in ANSI. If you're ever in ANSI, make sure to check it out. So we're gonna get some drinks and then we're planning to go to our favorite cheese restaurant for dinner tonight. So I'll take you along with me, let you know when we're there. I'll still be telling your mind And even though I see straight through it Oh, I'll still put my heart on the line I just got back from dinner and drinks and I'm going to clean my face now and just get ready for bed. My arm from the vaccine is feeling so painful. It's just what happens after getting a vaccine or like an injection or anything like it's totally normal. Dinner and drinks and meeting with our friends was really nice. I had such a good afternoon and I spoke French a lot. Like I tried really hard to speak French and just like find my confidence to do this. So that was really cool. We're probably just gonna like watch a movie and head to bed now. So nothing exciting. I have the day off tomorrow. So we're gonna hang out the whole day. We'll probably do something fun with Killian. I will see you tomorrow. Good morning guys. I didn't sleep very well. My arm is in so much pain. Like seriously so painful. I was just like tossing and turning and I like, couldn't get comfortable all night. Now it's 9.30 and I'm gonna make a coffee and just like try to wake up and like, I don't know, feel better. Uh, uh. feel the same? Hey guys, a few hours have passed now. I just didn't really feel like filming because I was just feeling so bad this morning. I think I've just woken up in a bad mood because I didn't sleep really well and my arms just like really painful. I was trying to put my bra on and I swear to God, it was like I was lifting like a fucking 1000 kilogram weight like over my head, it was horrible. And I think it's important that I share with you guys like how I'm really feeling, but uh, hopefully things are gonna start to turn around now because Killian and I are going for a big walk around the other side of Ansi. There's kind of like a lake in the middle and we're like going around the lake kind of. We're going to a brasserie where he worked last summer so I think it's just gonna be like nice to have a big long walk and stuff so and it's definitely something that always makes me feel better when I'm down is just to get out of the house and go for a big long walk so um, we're going to do that and I highly recommend if you guys are like feeling bad when you're watching this right now if it's possible get your joggers on get outside go for a walk listen to music clear your head so let's go for a walk Guys, Killian just bring me to the most horrible place ever if you have a bird phobia. He even grabbed my hand. He's like, make sure we're holding hands. Let me show you. Oh my God. Oh my God. An enclosure full of birds. What a nightmare. Baby, are you happy? I'm so happy. Maybe this is heaven. Maybe that's just you. I don't trust my judgment cause I'm just 22 When my tits run in circles, my heart is out in the rain I know that this is sudden, but do you feel the same? Do you feel the same? Do you feel the I can't make my mind up, I don't know. I thought that I would show you what I ended up picking up at the shops. I went to my favorite fast fashion store, Mango, and I picked up three things. So the first thing is just this white t-shirt here, and it's got some little frills in the side. So it's kind of like just like a plain tee, but 
a bit more fancy. I don't really have any tees and I always wear crop tops as you can see. And so I just wanted to pick up something I could like tuck into jeans and shorts and like not always be wearing crop tops. So I also picked up this one here as well. And it's kind of like a, it's a green color, super basic, super lightweight tee, perfect for summer. I really envision tucking this into a pair of white jeans. I think it will look really cool. So I picked that one up and my favorite thing that I got is this black dress. I'm gonna insert a photo here of what it looks like on because it's a bit hard to show you like this. It's like long and flowy. It's got this cut out at the back as well. Super summery and like a bit more fancy. Like I can wear it out for dinner with some red lipstick. And also Killian bought us some of this coffee. Thank you guys so much for hanging out with me. If you like this video, make sure to like, comment, subscribe. It really supports my channel. Oh, hey guys, I'm just taking a shower. I'll end the video here. See you next Sunday. I don't trust my judgment cause I'm just 22 and my dysfunctional circles my heart